subscribe on Chase to the podcast here on the YouTube and the Clubhouse app. We want to say thank you to both audiences for rocking with us because we wouldn't be where we are without you. So we definitely want to say thank you. We try to bring you nothing but premium content for what's going on on the app and what's also going on across the world. We also bring you our own exclusive content where we have a wide range of debates about sports, politics, music, relationships, all of the above. We are here to serve you. So please like, subscribe, and share our YouTube. Hit the bell at the top for notifications of all our latest videos. You're rocking with the best. Remember, there's only one straight no chases. Family off everything that's about what him. I'm talking about. It would have been a reverse shit in the elevator, right? Jay Z would have been the worst motherfucker in the world. That's what I'm his little brother, right? Right. Or, you know, right? Major. So you, it, it's like some. It's like y'all like. I hate to say it. Y'all want to demasculize the men. And that's my point, right? Right. That's my True. point. The, the the only thing you could do is nothing. Yeah. And you don't win. And that's what I'm pointing out. Society. I'm not saying Jay Z should have did anything. Y'all run this entire America. Mm. Y'all are oh, literally stronger Rue, than what women. Are you saying? So we're not fucking demasculating men here, okay? The instances uh, that we're bringing up represent it's the food emasculation in the water of a that's black man. Emasculating y'all. Oh, it's oh, emasculating. Right? Yeah, it's let me let me say this. Not demasculate. Hold on. Oh, wait, hold on, wait a minute, Rue, the, the, the example that Cap gave you was, wait a minute, hold on, the, ex, the example that Cap gave you was two extremes, one, the woman went off on the man and he knocked the shit out of her, everybody hated him, the second one was the Jay-Z situation, the woman goes off on the man, he restrains himself, and the next day for weeks and months, everybody made fun of how Jay-Z got his ass whooped by this yep. woman. So the fact yeah. is that, yes, there is something in America that is looking to emasculate the black man or men in general. That's just the, what we're dealing with. There's no way to win when you get in that situation. And this That's is a question, Cap. Is you there, Cap? This is another point y'all ain't even considering. So when that situation yeah, happened, we're going to just talk about what really happened in real life. After that situation happened, you know what I'm saying? Everybody was highlighting how the reason why Solange even did that was because Jay-Z got caught cheating. So people was ready to highlight yeah. the cheating scandal over yeah. the fact that he got assaulted in the elevator. Yeah. So I just want to mm -hmm. talk about what really well, happened. that's the case. So that, that, that's and we cut cool the that, female that cheat, we can beat her ass. I know. Cool. That's basically well, what they're saying. If it was okay, so, you see that <laughs> so if you was in the elevator, right, and like your sister was in the elevator, and you found out that her man, like, you know, being her wrong, do with you. Like that. I got to Would do you with you. Yeah. yeah, why would she put her hands on her sister's man? She's in violation for that. No matter what happened, she's in violation. Yeah, I, if I was Beyonce, I would have whooped her ass. Because, yeah, like, bitch, you tripping. Hell yeah, mind your fucking business, nigga. What the fuck does that have to do with you? That your sister man. Right. What that got to do? Unless you mad that he cheated on you. Right. <laughs> or cheated <laughs> with you. On top the of lunch, that, we be gang -gang. The launch is a girl's down. girl, and she ain't with all that. And you know, not nah, talking that gang gang shit. But I'm going to tell you, see, 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 you talking that shit, and y'all glorifying it. But then y'all get mad, right? When a nigga fuck you up, then you say we wrong. But then when it wears the gang gang shit at them. Because I'm gonna tell you right I'm now. I'm gonna tell you right now. The niggas that's around me, female or midget or nigga, try to put your hands on me and watch they don't gang gang your ass and beat the fuck out of you like you don't exist. And you talking that gang gang like it's cute. So you think it's cute till it ain't cute. Mm -hmm. Then you want to talk that shit about domestic, but what happened right. to gang gang? Should nobody be putting their fucking hands on nobody but gang gang to the sister? So what if it a broker motherfucking jaw? Then what? Is it gang gang then? Nah, then it's clank clank. No, Send him to jail. Fucking with a man. Is gang gang then? No. So why no, not he clank, clank. Gang, gang. Why y'all vouching for it? But this yeah, goes back to like yesterday. And listen, and, and listen, y'all yeah, be talking to... about that hitting that spitting shit is no, just listen. as bad. And Ray Nobody Rice wanted... vouched for her. Nobody vouched for her. No, no not he talking said. about this yeah, gang, gang, gang. gang. Nah, look, look, look. Literally, how about everybody keep their motherfucking hands to themselves? No, we literally one mic, one mic, one mic. Y'all want to play with it? Y'all want to play with it? But when we want to play with it, we can play with it too and make you feel fucked up. We can disregard all y'all feelings and emotions. We can talk about, yeah, he tossed that bitch in the trunk. Yeah, he killed that bitch. Yeah, we can talk about all that. How you going to feel about it? 
No one should so be why you, their hands. On so no. why are you playing with on the other side of? Look, we listen, never. I said, the oh, only reason why I say that is because I have seen, is right, um, my the only reason why I say that is because I have seen right brothers right seeing that somebody did their sister wrong and then they just turned up like you, what you fucking with my sister type shit you made her like that so I'm gonna whoop yo, your man, ass type yo stuff. man that's, so, that's some, I'm gonna tell you like this <laughs> if a woman's sister thinks she gonna put her hands on me behind me cheat on her sister right. I'm telling you right now, I'm going to jail. <laughs> and I'm going to tell the sister, if I get out and you fucking with the sister, you ain't whooped her ass, I ain't fucking with you. Because I'm coming home. So that, there it go. Yeah, Jay Z was talking about no physical harm. Huh? We, we were literally talking about only Jay Z. That was it. But the reason why. I said she got her sister's back. That's the only thing I said is why I assumed she was fighting the girl. Yeah, that's after what I'm saying. That's, that's not having nobody was, back. That's acting. Yeah, so pull. that's only. Nah, part, that's that's the only part stop. that came okay. up. Nobody that's having no impulse that control. Thing. Like control your shit. The fuck? Huh? What happened? Y'all keep that same energy. <laughs> keep yeah, that no same reason. energy. When something happened, I don't want right. to hear no boo hooing. Y'all gang gang. That's what it is, right? <laughs> Yes. No. Not what I said. What I said. That's having no. That's having no impulse control. Like mind your business. Like the first shit we learned when in kindergarten, nigga. Keep your hands to yourself. Like that's that wasn't her position to do that. So that's why I said what I said. You know what yeah. I mean? Like that. She kind of inserted herself and just like with a nigga, like like how everybody's saying the shit would have went left, nigga. That shit would have been all bad for him. Instead of hollering gang gang, it'd be clank clank, knock locking the nigga up. You yeah, know what I mean? Take like, gang, gang gang out of it. Right. I was just more so speaking on the sibling part. Like when you see your brother, your sister, like fuck. Don't nobody give a fuck. Mind your business. So Beyonce wasn't doing Mind your fucking business. Mind your business. Crisscross applesauce. Put the people in your your fucking business. Don't touch nobody. But the whole my whole thing is if you're if the person who got if the person who got cheated on didn't turn up, what the right. fuck did you feel like you had to turn exactly. up for? Like, I hate people who be overly, like, it's doing too much. Like, Mind even if business. I'm talking or about a situation and I say, you know, vent and talk my shit, I don't even want you to come out your mouth to talk shit about the person. You know what I'm saying? Because that's not your lane. That's not, mind your business. And the whole they time, cool. all, and they gonna like be cool, cool next back, week. Yeah. Whole time, your your own relationship is fucked up. You feel me? You ain't even taking care of your shit. You, but you worried about somebody else's shit. That's right. yeah, man, and that's why I've learned as an adult to keep your business to yourself. His brother's wife. The whole like, fact. Your business to yourself. Keep your relationship shit to yourself. Don't go around telling family. Don't tell nobody. Been there, done that. Mm-hmm. I keep my shit to myself mm-hmm. now because people will ride for you, and then you back with the person or never left them. That's some bullshit. You know what I was told? I was told a saying that goes like this. You may forgive them, but your friends and family won't. So stop telling people your business. Stop telling people your marital problems and what you got going on in your relationship if you know you're going to stay together at the end. Because they're going to try to ride for you and do goofy shit. That's how people get killed too, you know that? Sending your brothers, telling your brothers, yeah, he does this to me, da 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 Don't set people up. Just keep it to yourself. If you're not going to leave, you're not going to leave. You're going to stay. You're going to Mind your business, you live longer. Okay, don't, see no don't see your brother over here. Shit, there was a situation a couple of months ago where that played out just like that. You know what I mean? And, and mm-hmm. the guy, don't see your yeah. brother over here. Y'all gonna be mad. Exactly. And the guy that. tried to turn up and end up getting killed behind the shit. So yeah, man, yeah. fuck all of that. Mind your own fucking business. Stop putting people in your shit. You know you gonna go back to the nigga or the bitch or whatever. You feel me? So like, just fucking handle your own shit. I ain't. I'd never get involved. Even if I see, I, as much as I know, even if I see some domestic shit on the fucking like street, I don't get involved in that shit. I don't care if I know I can go press a pressure point. Fuck all of that. Mind your fucking business. Like B said, you live a lot longer. Yeah, yeah but dang, you know, you know, be about about you know. Shout out to our thoughts. Mind your business. Like if it's a female in your family and a nigga whooping her ass in front of you, okay, now go handle look. But yeah. Besides yeah, that, that's besides different, Ray. Right. Yeah. Then she turn yeah. around besides and go right back. The fuck? Yeah, Send that bitch to counseling. I'm gonna yeah, tell you from experience. I went and tried to. My cousin called me one time to go pick up something. So her man was fucking her up. I went over there blind. Thought I would. Got stabbed with a butcher knife. That shit ain't cool. 
I said I would never do this shit again. Learn from experience. You and right though, beast. Problem, cause she was right back with them. Act together. So it was a waste of time. It was a waste of blood, and it was a waste of my motherfucking energy to go do that. And I yep. and that. So you know what? It is what it is. Left less learn, but motherfucker stabbed me with a butcher knife. Damn. Did she go back to him? No, I'm Dude, just saying. I just don't like there. that shit. I don't like when motherfuckers laughing and kicking when the female put their hands on the man. But as soon as the nigga go ahead on and give her a motherfucking right hook and a left jab, all of a sudden he the worst nigga in the world. That shit ain't cool, man. I already told you. I think he's going to jab. That woman, on, that woman like spit on Ray Rice. That woman spit on Ray Rice. Ray Rice ain't played football since because he hit it with that right hook Wack was talking about. She spit on him. He and knocked the, out. He don't play football. No, you don't even hear about Ray Rice no more. Yeah, Isn't that how Antonio Brown shit started? Go ahead, Danny. No, I was saying as a woman, um, I said it earlier today, you don't put your hands on a nigga unless you plan to get hit like one. Like, Thank you for watching the video. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click, like, subscribe to the video, and follow us on all social media platforms. Come back daily to see new content or shit we throw up just to keep your day going. Remember, we put out nothing but premium content. The one, the only. Straight no chasers.